We went and got wood this morning. We had that little pickup loaded down with wood, big pieces of wood. The whole back of this truck was full, rounded off on the top, tied down. We brought it to the house, gave it a little bit of treatment here with this machine, called a log splitter. It was cut up in short pieces. So, that's the result of it. That was a pickup load. Y'all see how short it is. It's not long pieces. We didn't want it long. We got some small limbs too. We put them over here. But we loaded the truck that JD sawed it all down, sawed it up. Big tree. It's dead. And he asked Vince about it, and Vince said, take it all. So we've been going down there and getting it. A little at the time, we'll get the wood. Saw it up in short pieces. JD does that. I take the dolly, put it on there, roll it over to the truck, stack it up on the truck, and we bring it up here and split it with the log splitter. He's got a little bit of wood now, probably last a few days. But it's supposed to be getting down into the 30s again pretty soon in the next few days. That wood heater eats a lot of wood. As you can see, we have used up all of this wood that was over here. We had a big stack of it over here went from tree to tree. We moved some of these pallets. Used up all the wood that was over here. A little bit of pine, a little bit of cedar lay in there. But we've been working. We work down here. We eat good. Never go hungry down here. And if you like citrus, we've eaten all the satsumas. But there is still some kumquats, plenty of kumquats, lots and lots of them. Now, like I said, we don't go hungry down here. We work, but we don't go hungry. Plum trees have big purple plums on them. They're dormant right now. But they are the methylly plums. The big old purple plums. They'll grow on there. They'll come off. Those things are good. Trying to find a banana tree that actually produces bananas. I'm gonna find one, I'm gonna get it. It'll do well down here in this swamp. I appreciate everybody watching. Bye everybody.